Howdy, y'all. Hi, guys. It's Ryan. And Angela. From RA Music. Deep in the heart of Rocktober. <laughs> Yay. It's Rocktober 15th. Let me turn off this PA system over here. Okay. It was humming. Mm. Rocktober. It's Rocktober 15th. Yes, it is. Time for some more RA. Yes. Ask our name. I was really tired. October is flying by. We're halfway through already. It's <laughs> almost Thanksgiving. It's crazy. I was tired last week. Maybe yeah. I should take naps in the middle of the day. I think you should. I think I should. I, I, rock should naps. I think we, we all. all should. Everybody should have a siesta. Yes. Do siesta. That. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> exactly. Okay. First question. Okay. 94 Dodge Dude. Hey guys, what do you think is better? Spending $1,000 on new gear <laughs> or $800 on the used market. Also, what do you think? Spend $1,500 on a Mexican Fender EVH 5153 2x12 combo, or $1,300, mm -hmm. which is $200 less, on a USA PV 6505 2x12 combo? Thanks, guys. Mm -hmm. Well, that's a good question. 94 Dodge, dude. Yeah. $1,000 on brand new gear or $800 on used. I think you're going to get a little bit more for your money with the 800 yeah. used. So with, for the thousand bucks, you're just getting something that's worth a thousand bucks. Yeah. The 800 dollars, you're probably going to buy something that brand new was at least 13, 14, 1500 sometimes. Mm -hmm. So you get more value for your money when you buy. It's kind of like buying a car. Yeah. You get a lot more for your money to buy used. So mm -hmm. especially if you're looking at higher end gear. But if you can't find what you want for 800 bucks. I just yawned. <laughs> Did I say we were tired? Nap time. For, uh, you know, you may not be able to find the exact guitar you want or gear you want for right. on the used market. In that All case, I'm thinking about is that $200 extra that I can spend on shoes. That's right. I mean, because you could take that 200 bucks and uh, buy some pedals. Yeah, or, or shoes. So it just depends. It depends on what you're looking for. Right. Uh, I have a lot of guitars. Uh, not a lot. Some of my guitars were killer deals that I found used. Mm -hmm. So I'm a That's big true. fan of that. Mm -hmm. But I have also, to get what I really, really wanted, had to buy new. So mm -hmm. I think you get more for your money used, though. Yeah. Um, 1500 on the Mexican EVH 5150 or 1300 on the USA PV. That's a tough one. Again, that $200 cushion. I'm thinking shoes. Yeah, there's two hundred dollars there that you can spend on something else that you yeah. might not have. Those are, are very similar amps. They're very very similar. So yeah. Yeah, I don't know. That would be tough if I just really 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 wanted the EVH. Like I was a super 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 Van Halen fanboy. Yeah. I'd probably get the EVH, but uh, I don't know. Yeah. That's a tough one. The USA. I've heard, I've been hearing some things about the Mexican made ones that they're probably not quite as reliable as the USA 51, uh, 6505s. Right. So you have to research that and just see. That'd be a tough call though. I did, I do like the look of the 50 watt, uh, 5153. So. Right. Still a really tough one. 200 bucks worth of shoes though. 200 bucks worth For of shoes, Craig. One really nice purse. Craig, yeah, you could get a really nice purse, man, for 200 bucks. So. You, you gotta think about that. Oh, it wasn't Craig, it was Dodge Dude. No, 94 yeah, Dodge, Dodge Dude, sorry. Craig's next. CCH Craig. Hi, guys. Angela, have you ever fronted any bands as the lead singer, such as during college? And if so, tell us about it. What style of music? No. <laughs> That's very simple. No, I never had. I honestly, I've. Um, I'm really shy when it comes to singing, or I was then, when it came to singing in front of people. Um, I never really thought I had a good voice, or good enough voice to sing in front of people, uh, let alone thinking like, yeah, I'm going to start a band, and we're going to play blah, blah, blah. No. And if, it, if I did, um, knowing the era, you know, the group that I hung around with, it was probably some alternative band, more than likely, because that was real big back then. Um, when you were in college. When I was in college. Um, either that or country or something like that. Um, uh, but nowadays, if I did, I don't know. If you not, started a band like, now and you want to be the lead singer, what would you do? I would do something kind of like bluesy, jazz, something like that. I, Blues would be good. I think that that would be fun to do. So, 
That would be my style now. We want to talk about my college band. <laughs> Moving on. <laughs> That's going to be a question next week. Uh, <laughs> you know it will. Maybe if it is, it is. If it's, it is. But we're not going to talk about it right now. Stay so. lucky. <laughs> Uh, next, we have uh, Guitars77 says, mm -hmm. how is your online store going? That's a great question. <laughs> it's there. We have one. <laughs> We've been yeah. talking about this, actually, because, you know, yeah. it's a funny thing. You know, we do a lot of social media stuff and mm -hmm. YouTube stuff, but, mm -hmm. you know, we spend, man, maybe even 80% of our time, probably, if not more, teaching. Like, yeah. we have a lesson studio here. We have, I don't know, what, 45 students, I yeah. guess. Yeah, easy. Uh, so we spend the majority of our time teaching private music lessons. And mm -hmm. so, you know, that takes up the bulk of what we do. It's also the majority of the, the income that RNA Music makes. So mm -hmm. um, online stuff, you know. It's getting there. I'm adding stuff, but I'm a little behind on adding things to the store. Because we yeah. get local walk-in, drive-up traffic to, yeah. and between all that stuff, you know, having a massive online store. We're just not big enough to do that yeah. at the moment. Well, we don't have the manpower to make all that work and yeah. handle that. Now, we do sell and stuff online. And a whole online. enough inventory to make it like, woo, look at this, look at all this that we have here, so. Yeah, well, somebody's got to take pictures of everything and then write up descriptions, then upload it to the website and then handle all that stuff, so. Yeah. I just don't have the time to spend all day doing website stuff. Yeah, and we don't have the wherewithal to hire somebody enough to yeah, make it worth enough. the balance of it. It wouldn't be worth it to yeah have somebody manage it for us. So so it's a it's a work in progress. I, I kind of upload stuff to it as I have the time to do it. But uh, you know we do a lot of business over the phone and through email and, and contacts. People call us. Hey, do you have this? Yeah, I got one. Or no, I don't have one, but I can get one. Or, all that kind of stuff. So uh, it's there. Mm -hmm. It stuff gets added to it as I have the time to <laughs> add stuff to it. So yeah, it's a lot. There's a lot of behind the scenes stuff that unless you've worked at a store or ran a business, it's kind of there's a lot going on. So it's, yeah, there's a lot. There is. So yeah, mm -hmm. maybe we'll see some changes coming up in the next year with the web stuff. We'll see how it goes, but... Uh, Who knows? Yeah. Thanks for asking. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe this weekend. Much I always appreciate. intend to like do a lot of online stuff work on Saturdays, mm -hmm. and then customers come in all day. Yeah. And i got to talk to real it's humans like we have, face to face. Yeah, we, we, I think we prefer the human interaction than having to... I definitely know, do. Emails and phone calls and stuff like that, so... Um, phone yeah. calls are one thing, because I enjoy like chatting to a human and mm -hmm. hearing their voice and talking to people. Yeah. And the face-to-face -face interaction is always fun. Um, but, yeah. So I guess that answers that question. I don't know. <laughs> it's a work in progress. It is. It's R77. It is. It is. Uh, John Burdett. Yes. Ryan, you do I look know. sexy with no makeup on, too. LOL. Ha <laughs> 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 I was talking about last week. Cause yes. Because I was like, I haven't... We were no makeup, no... We were at, she didn't at have our dining makeup. room table. I didn't have any makeup. Fun. Yeah. <laughs> you do look handsome. I do. Well, you know, I don't need makeup because I have a beard. I have a beard. Good looking. I have a beard. I don't need makeup. So. Yes. Yeah, you do. Bread. Good video. Used to. Hope you guys have a great weekend. Oh, hey, I turned 50 on the 8th. Does that make me vintage? LOL. Cute story with the names. And it's so funny. I was talking to someone just the other day how, you know, for us, you know, 50 the age 50 is just, you know, like 10 years away. And so it was just wild to think, you know, it's 10 years and it, two months. Yes. It's getting younger. 50, I think is getting younger to me because I don't feel like almost 40. Oh. So it's, I do today. <laughs> today. <laughs> there I are days almost. that I do feel almost 40, but it's, it's just funny how it's, you know, 50, I don't think a 50 is vintage. I think like if you are a baby boomer, maybe, you know, 50, you're not a baby boomer. So, um, you're not vintage till you're 65. Yeah. Sure. You know, if unless you're you getting social security check, you're not yeah. vintage. There you go. There you go. So not yet. Not yet. Not, not yet. John. yet. <laughs> uh, that wasn't really a question, but just a comment. <laughs> we just thought it was a fun comment. Yeah. Yeah. I think I look good. We think so. For nearly 40. 
Yeah. Uh, all right, guys. So that's all we got for this week. That was the only questions we got. So that's all we got to answer. And Chris, we're at our, kind of at our time limit. So it's yeah. time to wrap it up because they have to go teach a million more students. And, uh, a million. A mi- well, not a million. But we have quite a few this afternoon to get rocking and rolling on. Yes. They'll be here any minute. So wrapping it up. Uh, if you have any questions for next week, Do-do-do. type them in. Leave a question below in the comment section of this YouTube yes. video. And we'll try to answer them next week. If we have time. Mm-hmm. Any question will do. Yeah, any question. Doesn't have to be guitars, but it can be guitars. Yes. It could be whatever. So, all right. Thank you guys so much. Appreciate it. Keep the music alive. Don't forget it. Wheelie, 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 wheelie. Squealy, deedly. Deedly, deedly. That, that, deedly, deedly, deedly. My shoulder. Oh. I'm nearly 40. Ow. <laughs> 40 hurts. 40 is going to rock. 40 is going to rock. I've decided. You need to decide that. I need it. I've decided right now. 40 is going to rock. All right.